channel. Today I wanted to film a um, get to know me tag. Um, since I'm new here on YouTube and you guys are new subscribers, I felt that it was only right that we got to know each other. So if you'd like to get to know me, please keep... Alright. So I just looked some questions up on the internet and I screenshotted them so I'm going to be looking down at my phone to look at the questions. Um, okay. First one is name. My name is Chanel. I go by Nell only because it's really difficult to spell my name and it's just easier for me to say Nell than to spell it and you guys would be calling me not Chanel. So Nell is good. Um, birth date. My birth date is December 26th, the day after Christmas. Place of birth. I was born in Las Vegas, Nevada. I know a lot of you are probably thinking Las Vegas. Yes, people live in Las Vegas and we don't live on the Strip or in hotels. There are houses in Las Vegas and there are normal people here. Um, sign. I am a Capricorn. Occupation. I am currently a student. I graduated last year from FITM um, with a degree in apparel industry management which is similar to apparel manufacturing and I am currently pursuing a nursing degree. Um, hair color. My hair color is mostly brown. I have a really strange tint of natural like red in my hair. I don't know. My hairstylist finds it odd too but I don't know where it came from, how it happened. But my hair is technically brown. Um, hair length. Um, I guess it's shoulder length, but I wear extensions all the time. Um, eye color, brown. Best feature. Um, I don't know. I think I have really nice eye braces. Nope, I have never had braces. Piercings, I have my ears pierced and I have my belly button. Um, tattoos, no tattoos righty or lefty. I'm a righty. I try to be a lefty. It doesn't work. Um, first, best friend. My first best friend that I remember, her name was Heather. Um, we were best friends when we were like four or five and she actually passed away. Um, when we were five, she drowned. It was really sad. Um, first award. I think it was in first grade. My teacher, Mrs. Roloff, I believe her name was, gave me an award for being the most fashionable student. I'll take first sport. I played softball and tennis. Um, I don't know which one was first. I feel like we'll go with softball just because I know it was more legit. Like I did tennis lessons, but I was never. Like, I never pursued it, but softball, I actually did. I was on the team, and we had our games every week. It was really fun. I was, like, six. Um, first real holiday, I'm going to say, oh, that's sad. I was born the day after Christmas, so I didn't even have Christmas until a full year later. That sucks. Um, what was my first real holiday, then? I don't know. Halloween? Valentine's Day? New Year's? I don't know. You pick one. I don't know what is considered a real holiday. Um, first concert. It was in sync. Oh my goodness. It was so much fun. My cousin Alexis. Hi Lexi. It was really fun. We got a limo and we had really good seats and I just remember it was like super fun. I was so into Justin Timberlake and you know every little girl was back in the 90s. Like we were all thinking that we were going to marry a member of NSYNC. It was awesome. I love it. Currently listening to nothing currently thinking about what I'm going to eat. I actually know what I'm going to eat. I'm going to my mom's for dinner, so I'm really excited for that. I'm currently wearing, this is a, like an olive green sweater. Um, it's really long and oversized. I got it from H&M. Favorite film. I used to always say The Notebook, and I feel like that's so cliche, like, go oh, The Notebook, but I really do, I love The Notebook, but I also really, really, really love Beaches with Bette Midler show. I watch a lot of TV, like, Netflix is my life. I have a lot of favorite TV shows. I like Scandal, Blacklist, um, I'm watching Jane the Virgin right now, How to Get Away with Murder. My favorite color is pink favorite song. You know, I don't know. I feel like there's not one song that I like 
always go back to and listen to on repeat. Mm, I don't know. I think maybe Week by SW's favorite restaurant. Probably P.F. Chang's. I go every year for my birthday. Now I'm addicted. It's so good. I love it. The Szechuan shrimp, but they took it off the menu, so you have to ask for it because they still have the sauce. They just don't put it on the menu, but it's so good. Favorite store? Maybe BCBG. Favorite <coughs> magazine? Cosmo. I open Cosmo and I go right to the, um, what is it, like the secret set or the confessions? It's called confessions. I go right to the confessions and I like binge read all of those and then I'll flip through everything else but I kind of get really shy to read Cosmo in public because I don't want to like accidentally flip to the naughty sections and someone's like peeking over my shoulder and they're like why is she reading that it's kind of risque but I like Cosmo favorite shoes okay I am a shoe hoarder this is a really bad question I love all shoes um you know I actually I have one pair of shoes that are really sentimental to me because I bought them with my own money for my college graduation and they're a pair of like mint green suede jimmy choo pointed toe pumps they're so good and they're so pretty i don't think i could ever get rid of them and they're just so sentimental because i wore them to my graduation it was such a big accomplishment it's like i love them. currently single or taken i am taken and i have been for six and a half i'm currently eating i am currently eating a granola bar um it's like almond crazy it's like almond clusters with almond butter it's really currently watching before this i was watching real housewives of orange county if you watch real housewives of orange county give us a thumbs up future do i want children yes i do i want i think three maybe stop at two depending on how crazy that gets. do i believe in god yes i do do i believe in love at first sight I believe in lust at first sight. I think love is something that develops for a person and you have to spend a little bit of time with the person before that you know you love them. I think obviously there's attraction and when you see someone you're like, oh my god, I need them in my life. But yeah, okay, I understand that. But I think that love is a lot deeper than what do I believe in ghosts. I don't necessarily believe in ghosts, but I believe in like spirits and demons and negative energies. Um, yeah. Do I believe in aliens? I don't know about that one. I, I feel like I get asked that question a lot and I still don't know the answer because so many people are saying that they've seen aliens or that aliens have abduct, abducted them and I don't believe in soulmates. Yes, I do. I think that there's absolutely someone that was meant for you out there I think that God I believe in God I think that God places a certain person in your life and will continue continuously place them in your life until you guys find each other I absolutely believe that uh, do I believe in heaven yes I do but do I believe in hell yes I do do I believe in kissing on the first date no I am like really really strict about kissing I think Kissing is something special and it should be preserved for someone that you plan to be with. Um, I think that if you kiss someone on the first date, it doesn't mean that you're going to get a call back. So I think that you should save kissing. I mean, sure, I'll hug you. I'll give you a kiss on the cheek. But kissing on the lips to me is, it's special and secret. So I personally wouldn't. That is it. Those are all of the questions. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.